my people hey hey wonders they say it shall never end no be small thing, no. Hey, no be small matter day for grand. To read your brother, to read full grand. We are on a day, make on a carry on a chair, make on a consider, make on a hear to read. As day they break, na different, different shocking story, different, different to read from either Wumi or Mama Mobad. Na then be this. That then be the storytellers, now then be the drama queens where we get for inside this social media space. Hey, hey, wonder so you know go ever fit end. Normally, they say if mama decide to carry in picking, go sell them for markets and any amount where them price and nine it go sell them. And as it take be like this, no be only any amount to before they go talk a. Hey, for the picking head, they go first of all ask for the mama of the picking. Oh, more this one, he choke. Now, for inside this very update, now they say, Mama Mobad, don't they cry out, oh, don't they sober? They regret all the things we she do to Mobad when in RIP. Oh, no be smart, you know. <laughs> they say, Wumi, don't they put on woto woto for Mama Mobad body? Don't they call her greedy woman? Say, wait, seem be her problem. Of which Mama Mobad forgets, say, no matter how she take go become slave for Wumi, no matter how she take carry Wumi, no matter how she take carry Wumi as in-law, she remains an in-law. Wumi can never be the fruit of her womb. The Wumi can never replace Mubad. Wumi can never be that person where she carry for nine months. Wumi can never be that person where she Enter labor room, give birth to on that fateful day. Hey, hey, my people, no be smart, you know. On several occasions, are they always they come out come and say, She now, which kind mama be this one? And up till today, till tomorrow, I never feel still get person where go answer me, tell me the calm mama where mama mobad be. Oh, since I was born and now I am getting old, I have never in my life seen this kind of mother before. Hey, hey, when you start the wine and dine with people, wake by your son, or we know somebody, we know somebody, wake on another somebody, wake by your son, waiting you expect. Oh, man, no, be smart, you know. We make so many people come, they talk, say, she na money, na e mama mo bad. They look for like this, we go make her betray her only light of her womb. We go make her turn her back on Imole. So many questions, so where people they ask, we be say we never fisty get answer to the question. Say waiting, mama mo bad they find for Sokoto. We no day for inside her Shokoto. We be say normally if to say she come out fight for this justice for Mobad, she come out stand gidigba as a mother say na like this it be this money where they where they to say they offer her we make her turn her back on Imole turn her back on the justice. On stand on the anti-justice then. She for no get on time stand, my people. Because now her son, she have an entitlement too as a mother. But because she start to follow Wumi, they suppose Wumi come out to say, no be as it take baby this. Hey, hey, now you don't they see the repercussion. As it take the B for inside this very update, they say, Mama Boba, don't they cry out, oh, she don't they regret because Wumi, don't they put her woto woto for her body. Um, now this one they talk say people anybody where they beat drum for you make you they careful and make you make sure say you they listen to the drama you they listen to the beating make you know go they dance the dance of the spirit oh no be smart you know my people no be smart you know when i know say when turn to dk and iabo ojo they back mama mobad they give her assurance they give her full assurance like choma and debido assurance kind of Mama Moba, they stand, they swell up, they poof, they buga, say, eh, she don't get people waste stand for her. But as it take me like this, everybody don't sorry, oh. everybody don't face the one way in face, they don't leave Mama Moba. And like this, so, he never even reach anywhere, Moba never even enter ground. She don't, they regret her action. She don't, they ask questions, say, had I know, had I know always comes at last. Guys, men are can no con. Make a no come, they stress the matter. Make una gather, make una hear and life and direct for inside this very conversation. Make una hear as Mama Moba take the cry out. Like small picking, 
They sober, they regret our action. Hey, hey, don't be smart, you know. Inside life, things really, they happen. Make somebody come be very, very careful so that you know we we'll can't go sell the only thing where you get left for this world. They chase, waiting you know they find you. Amen, oh, my people. If you never subscribe to this channel, wait till you gain. Please subscribe. Click on the notification bell so that they go notify you anytime when I drop to read to read like this. And I say remember when I humble get a kiss. I mean they bring una latest and latest of get to read. I beg make una help me share this video. Make una share this video. May they come here so many things where they happen for inside this justice for Mobad. Make we gather, make we hear and life and direct from this very conversation as they take to come. You show some motherhood. You you know you sneak to the school and try to see your child and see how he's faring. Show some motherhood, but she didn't do that. But when the boy went through 15 years of strife and suffering and you know uh, uh, loneliness, lacking that mother touch in his life, which led him to choose the wrong you know uh, partner as a wife. Because when you lack a mother touch as a kid, you you tend to lose touch with actual female nature, you know, and then you just go into to choose your choice of uh, female, I don't know if they end up to be wrong because you don't really know how femininity works and then you lack that mother love and then you are desperate for it and then you just go into the hands of anybody that, or any woman that uh, shows you love, you know, but not, but does not actually mean that she loves you. So then after 15 years and then the boy is actually picking up, then she came back to the boy's life, you see. So it means that she's for the money, you know, she's for the benefits, she's, she's where, the money is you know she's where the enjoyment is she's where the uh the the uh the incentive is you understand and she when she came back and the boy was trying to bring his mother and his father together you understand me as he and also to you know put money in their pocket and to get them to live a better life but you see upon his, the, the demise of mobad uh the opposite happened when we use the opposite to polarize both the mother and the father and then bring the mother to her side and get her to commit herself to the to her own storyline and make her to make certain public statements to make it seem as though you know baba mubad is the wrong person and those things cannot be taken back because she's now into it and having to come out and say all those things i said was wrong is this a disgrace so as a whole that person should think about it as what she has eaten and what she has benefited from you know at the uh stance so that is the price that you know she has to pay but we are saying that it's not too late for her to come out it's not of course she'll be bashed she'll be disgraced she'll be embarrassed but it is still not too late for her to come out and say the truth about the whole thing that led to the death of her husband i think they're just telling her that well adurato will be uh will, will be will be will be implicated there is no way Adura will be implicated because adura was not adura did not stab his brother so, you know, they are trying to make it seem as though if you talk, then whatever we have to give you and Adora, we're not going to give it to you. So it's still that money and that incentive that she's trying to protect for herself at the end of the day. So greed is one thing and it's a problem in our society and everybody's affected, mother, father, uh, leaders, citizens, is greed. And yeah, so let me just stop here, but that's the picture. I would just like to add this, just to elaborate what Fortman uh, Carter said. Yes, in the interview of Mommy Moba, she said a statement there that actually confirms what you've just said. And she said that, I quote, according to her, that uh, even though I know that I stand to benefit the most from my son's wealth. Who told her she stands to benefit the most? the person that has not been there and how did she know about benefiting the most is that what they told her to keep her quiet so i'm just saying from what according to mommy mobile thank you um, thank you very much uh prince let's have you i like the narrative that everybody has been given so so far and you know i've learned a lot of things from from this this afternoon it's <laughs> it's so amazing and you know uh, yoruba will say to bat je dudu enwe ole enwe ole ka dudu it is as simple as that
that's what I've seen about Yamobad. Because a case now is becoming something that even so toxic to her by herself. Now, either she's passing through a lot or a lot is passing through her. She can't come out in one way or the other. But there is still room for her to do, to do the correction. If she can reason very well, and she come out and say, these are things that have happened, these are things that make me to keep silent, these are things that is making me to talk or to say something like this. If she can come out to say that, why not? Case closed, we understand, it, it means that it's giving us more clue about what I've buying his son. That's one. See, there is no doubt that Wumi um, supporters, that they don't know what they are doing. There is no doubt about it. It is so clear, it is so glaring. But, you know, they will say, I'm a big money, I can't be go. And I think, you know, when Karimo is realizing some of the mistakes that she made in the past, and she's, she's trying as much as possible that, even if you are not listening to anybody now, I think I've come to realize that this is what an how i've made this mistake this mistake let us correct it this is one some truth that i've heard about this thing that even maybe my sister is not even telling me because he wants to hide some secret now you have been giving a lot of different narratives and you are doing a lot of damage control can we look at it this way then the see, see her as an enemy so that's the reason why that in their camp there are a lot of things that is undergoing they are preaching her and she can't take that again don't forget even tibuki jesse to pass on from banyo suni public oh mind but a auto that is jayon po you know i will come on you are coming against her so if she can come out to come and say that you know that a lot of behind the scene has happened so no doubt but one thing i know is this you know when we are talking sometimes they will come they will be saying blah 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 a lot of things that they will come and say and see how they are coming on here now to expose some of the things that they think that, uh, that is hidden. Some of the things that they themselves know that these are truth. See the way they are coming to explain it. Just like nobody asks you. And I always keep saying something. I said, see, if, we, if all of us said we fold our hand, we don't want to fight for justice for Mubad. Mubad himself, God has helped him to fight a lot of battle on the ground that we ourselves, we can't just even explain. We can't just even explain. Yamubara said, Ah, Mukwe and Timmy, a way, Jay Bule, Jay Tijadi, a Jay Jadla, or may you can't even come to defend that in public. That's one. Then, two, looking at the benefit, who told you that you are the most beneficiary to any wealth of Mubad or to the death of Mubad? How did you know that? Is that the reason why you have to decamp to someone else or to someone who you know allegedly that you may have one or two things to say about what I find your son? So we are just getting there. As I said before, I said, see, there are a lot of hidden secrets behind all these things. The thing that is hidden. <laughs> like just like breeze and that's what is happening now imagine karibu can come out and be saying all this this is just something that happened like two weeks ago i know that there are some things that will have come out that will have even see more than this. So, you know, 
a lot of things about to come out. A lot of bombshell. Yeah. Thank you very much, Prince. Um, and everybody that have said one thing or the other has... But immediately they see us fighting, they will come for us, they will doing blah, 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 as if they are innocent. The, Jumi and Maisi, they said, they made a statement that, Jumi, they said Maisi said she go and made a finance about Wumi. Because since they are supporting her, they don't know anything about her. She's not telling them the truth, they don't, she, she's not talking truth to them. So they need to go and make investigation on, their, on her own. And she sees that a lot of people that she's, she's doing a finance, she send people to Lagos to make the finance maybe the people that are closer to me or maybe nearby them. They said the, 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 the feedback she gets is a very bad one at that. That the feedback they give her, she's a very bad feedback. And they even said the way she's treating Yamubad is, a, is very bad. But that woman don't have a choice. They said the way they, they, they are treating Yamubad now is a very, very bad manners. But that woman, she didn't have a choice and she cannot come outside because she has already messed up big time. And she cannot back her. So all this one that Yamubad is doing, you can see now, even Yambo, you can see she's not happy. She's not fine. Let's be serious. Let's be let's be let's be frank with ourselves. Yamba is not fine. She, in the last time she come outside, she 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 is she as she was. She as she is. What's fine in her? She's not fine. She's just trying to. She didn't have a choice. I know that she's trying to protect someone here. She's trying to protect someone here. That's why she didn't have the boldness to come outside and come and talk. That's why Mumi is using that to 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 to, to pin her down. That woman, she's trying, she's going through a lot. But she didn't have a choice here. And I pray she, she overcome all this nonsense that she's putting herself into. But I don't know how you are going to be supporting but, someone. But, 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 sorry, 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 sorry. You said, um, yeah, Mubad is going through a lot and she doesn't have a choice. I don't understand that, that sentence. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, that she, because she's trying to protect someone now. She cannot just face that because she's trying to protect all that person with all means. That's why she didn't have a choice. If she's not protecting someone, she falls out. Talo no, talo no, go protect the mother and show Talo no. You cannot say you, you don't. You cannot that you okay. We cannot say that she's protecting a mother and show me. Ah, the son thing. Ah, let's conclude. Me, who protects a mother and show me? Adura is in the house. Adura want to learn. There is something. Hold on, hold on now. Hold on. I want to get to you now. You said the Yamubad is not fine. She's not Yabi. Is that not what you said? Adela. Eh, and I said that who sent her not to be fine? Who sent her not to be fine? Is Baba Mubad not fine? Who sent her not to be fine? She but chose the camp she belongs. Bambubad is not with lies. That's why he's fine and he's glowing. And so who you now said that she took the part now? You're not getting it. That's our choice. Nobody chooses it for her. I don't understand. Because I don't choose her phone now. She chose it herself. Um, you said I'm clueless. What, 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 um, you don't uh, understand. You said I'm clueless. Too. What what your daddy was trying to do is to also corroborate what Adiola was saying, but in a more enlightening manner, okay, so as not to mislead uh, the people that are on this platform listening to it. Because actually, she led uh, Mama Mobad brought herself to the situation that she's in because she had a choice to stand on justice and to uh, act like a real mother of a child that was killed. So she had a choice to demand justice and also to stand with Baba Mobad, you know, to take a stand with him, to request that what killed my son, what happened to him, and to request justice the right way. But she decided to uh, allow those uh, expert manipulators who are women's friends, especially some of them who are celebrities, to use a lower nature and a greed to hook her 
and to use her to advance their own interests, you know, in such a way that she's now in it, like she's, she, she, you know, they just sacrificed her and now she can't get out of it. So whatever she's feeling, whatever pains, whatever regret or embarrassment or disappointment she's feeling is something that she's now forced to, you know, uh, to endure. She's trying to endure it because of the embarrassment of coming out and saying the truth. But she still has a way. There is still a window now because the DNA is yet to be out. And also the autopsy result is yet to be interpret interpreted, although it's out. So she still has a chance. It is a tiny window to, to come out and say what she actually knows. So she allowed herself to be used because of her greed and her lower nature. And they simply used the vendetta that she had with Baba Mubad. They use it, they re, they re, it's just like you, you resurrected an old, you know, disagreement you have with your husband and they use it as a grievance so as to corral support for Wumi and then get paid in return. So that's what is really going on. So she had a chance, but she chose that way just because of, you know, some incentive, financial and of course, psychological in my, yeah. So we are both saying the same thing, but Baba, so uh, Daddy York is just trying to shed more light on what you're saying, Adiola. So you're not saying anything that is wrong. And you're of course not clueless. So that's it. Thank you, Fortman, for that um, explanation. I was, I was trying to tell Adiola that um, the the path Mama Mubad chose, she chose it herself, and anything she gets from it, so you can go on, Adiola, and continue with your thought. Adiola, you stay there. I don't think she's saying anything again. Yeah, let me just give a little analysis. On yeah, I'm there. I'm there. Because okay. he has already explained what I'm trying to say. So that's why I don't talk again. Uh, okay. Because in spite of Adora's, uh, because you can see that during the coronal inquest, when Adora was called to make his own account, to give his account of what really happened, you know, she uh, incentive and uh, i don't know i don't uh, she encouraged adora not to say what he knows about the situation because she according to what we heard she, she she took him out of the courtroom and you know went on and you know she went she oh, he's, he's going to like comply with whatever and expedite this move uh, the drive for justice but she intentionally did that and she obstructed justice by forcing adora to keep mute or to keep quiet and since then Ad the corona inquest has not been able to call adora up and ask him what really happened or you know what he knows because of the excuses that adora was given as a result of his mother's pleading plea, uh, plea, pleas so she brought herself into that situation. But you see, a lot of people who are like this, they always want to blame people for their situation. They are always Baba Mubad. You can see what happened when the video, when she made a video and she was trying to uh, accuse Buki JC of, you know, leaking out her location or something. She also tried to tie the whole thing on Baba Mubad as though Baba Mubad was the one who sent, who in, uh, in connivance with Buki JC decided to, you know, send, maybe some people to reveal her in that location, maybe they want to kill her, and all those alarmism, and to create a sensation and Ghana a thread again for Baba Mubad. So, she, basically, she really knows what she got into before she got into it, but she does not really understand the consequences, and the, she, she has not fully weighed the consequences of it. That was why, when they were having that discussion in the house, when she was given an envelope, you can see someone that looks like Wumi was close to her, you know, try to talk, trying to, you know, covering her face with some hat, some pink, you know, you know, hat or something. And was trying to talk to her and trying to tell, get her to be on the same page with the storyline. And we can see Tonto Dike 
and uh, Yabuju, they were there, you know, trying to, you know, pander to her, trying to, you know, you know, to molikudu her, you know, to get her to go along with the script and to just, you know, stay on the script. So, you know, they are going everywhere for her, you know. So where are all those molikudu now? Where, are, where is Yabuju? Where is all those things now? You know, they are no more there, except maybe they want her to say something against Bamobad and maybe to give her some money again and then they come around her and get her to whip up the policy once again. So, uh, it is, you have to understand that greed is one thing, you know. Greed can make you do something that you are not supposed to do. It will make you to see the truth and ignore it if you allow yourself to be taken over by the lower nature of it, of greed. So she's greedy because she left Mubad when Mubad was just a kid because, and she knows the prophecy that was said about that child. And as a mom, even though you left the, the man, you shouldn't leave the kid. You should be going to the school and checking the kid out. You should be taking food to visit your kid during break time and say, look, don't worry about that, your naughty father. Take this uh, bread and eat. Take this gari. Take this uh, meat pie. Take this